Alex, bro, this time you're 100% not going to pass our challenge. Why would you say that, villagers? I'm 100% sure I will. No, you won't pass the 24-hour challenge in the red circle today. Do you seriously think you can? Hey, 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 hey. I'm set to outdo you, villagers. Well, we're gearing up right now, and you better do the same. This challenge is no joke. All right, I'll say hello to my subscribers for now. Hello, dear friends, it's Alex Bro, and today we will undergo the villagers challenge in the red circle. So they think I can't, but I've already survived in the red circle. If you haven't seen the hacker series, be sure to watch it. It'll appear on the screen. Dear friends, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel now. And the question of the day, what's your favorite shape? Circle, square, or triangle? Write in the comments. Don't forget to share this video with your friends to see what they think too. Well, I'll get ready accordingly. Let's see, I'll take with me, I'll bring one pickaxe, one sword, and even one loaf of bread, leaving the rest behind. Even my phone, I won't play Minecraft within Minecraft. Heading to the villagers. So villagers, I'm ready. Where's your red circle? Whoa, what's this villagers? He 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 he, this is the red circle, Alex bro. How do you expect me to spend 24 hours in that tiny space? I mean, look at it, I don't even fit. Stand on one leg maybe? Can't you stand on one leg for 24 hours? <laughs> Very funny villages. Oh my gosh, I can't just stand like that. Then you won't get five stacks of emeralds. How much? Five stacks of emeralds? Yeez, for five stacks of emeralds, I could even stand on my head. Um, uh-huh, what did you say? Oh, nothing, just thinking aloud, villager. Wait a minute, I'll be right back. Well, 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 the cunning villagers thought they could trick me, but I'll show them, guys, and you'll help me because, thanks to you, I've come up with the perfect plan. We're taking the pickaxe. We're gearing up for an adventure, and I found the perfect spot to dig a secret passage. I'll be taking not just one, but two crafting tables, you know, just to ensure I'm doubly prepared for whatever lies ahead. Right here, I have a chest filled with thrilling surprises. Inside, there's a lucky block ready to reveal its secrets later, alongside diamonds and irresistible cake and the true game changers, some amazing gadgets. I'm taking it all, the chest, the furnace, everything. There, that's perfect. But the most crucial items for me, these two pills, the red and the gray ones, they're key to my plan. Look, with this pill, I can shrink. Wow, I've become super tiny. And with this other pill, I can grow back to my normal size and accordingly spend the 24 hour challenge in the red circle. What a great plan, all thanks to you guys. Let's rush to the villagers. Villagers, I'm now ready. Alex, bro, do you seriously think you can handle it? Let's start on the count of three. Okay, villagers, I'm ready. Start counting, but I've got a special trick up my sleeve. You'll be amazed at what I've planned. One, two, three, wipe your bottom. What? Didn't get it. Impossibly. What didn't you get, villagers? Now I can stay here as long as needed? That's not fair, Alex, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How is it not fair? I've shrunk myself and can now spend 24 hours a week, even a month here. Oh, come on. The wind might blow him away. He's too small. Well, okay. All right, Alex, bro, you'll stay here for 24 hours. We'll be watching, but if you step out of the red circle, you lose. Yes, yes, you lose. Watch away. I'll hold my ground here and you villagers watch as long as you want. I won't step out of the red circle. Whoa, the round begins. Uh, all right, the villagers have departed. Perfect, now our survival adventure begins. First, let's set up the chest. Yes, that's it, placing the chest. Wow, it's enormous. It will shield me from the sun's relentless rays, especially since we're so tiny and could easily get scorched. Next, we need a cake, and let's place this gigantic one right here carefully. A gigantic cake, incredible! Guys, we're definitely not going to starve here. We have a chest, so let's put in our items that we won't be needing for now. Excellent. And even the lucky block, which I'll open at the end of the episode. Make sure to watch till the end to see what we get. It might be something really interesting. Next, I need to build a house because the sun is shining very brightly and it's hot. And I only have one bottle of water. To do this, we'll arrange planks here, like so, carefully laying them down there. Perfect. Using this tool, I gather planks efficiently. Notice how I quickly collect small planks, positioning myself cautiously to remain within the red circle's confines as our goal is to endure here for 24 hours. Ha ha ha, gathering blocks effectively. We're like nimble mice nibbling through this block. Now it's time to erect a cozy shelter, skillfully assembling it here, achieving a splendid structure. 
Here, we'll have the walls sturdy and reliable, and right over here, a spot for the door, a vital entrance indeed. This area, marked for the front door, will be strategically placed right here, forming the welcoming gateway. The progress is remarkable, folks. I believe it's turning out superbly. We're well equipped to withstand a 24-hour stay here, especially with nightfall imminent and potential monster appearances, making a shelter indispensable. Palm, power, and palm, and just like that, our roof is nearly done. A real showpiece of craftsmanship. Oh, hello, Alex, bro. How's it going? I see you've built a little house. Yeah, villager, check it out. I've built myself a shelter, so I'm set to survive. So you think you're going to win, huh? Sure do. I'm ready for victory. Hmm. Well, we'll just have to wait and see, won't we? His words a bit ominous. We'll see, he says. Guys, got me alert. I've got to stay sharp. The challenge just intensified. It's time to double down and outsmart whatever they throw my way. Well then, dear friends, our little house is essentially built. All is quiet for now. Since the villager hinted at a threat, we need to prepare for whatever comes next. Look, I have diamonds in my inventory, but I need to craft armor from them. To do that, I'll need to set up a crafting table. What to remove, what to remove. I need to clear some space. Let's remove the cake as our hunger level is fine for now. So we simply, simply break down this cake. Pew, pew, pew. Fantastic. We've cleared some room and got the crafting table in place. With the table all set, it's time to transform these diamonds into armor. I'm about to create what could be Minecraft's tiniest armor. Crafting the boots, shaping the helmet, then assembling the pants and finally forging the chest plate from diamonds. Success. We've got a complete armor set and I've even unlocked an achievement. Let's check out their size. Wow. They are incredibly tiny, just like me. It's like they've shrunk down to a whole new level of miniature. Remarkably, each piece is about one pixel in size. Now I'll grab this minuscule armor, the smallest in Minecraft, and suit up. Perfectly fitted, fully armored. Check this out, guys. I look awesome. This armor isn't just protective, it's stylish too. Ready for any unexpected events. I've got my shotgun handy for any nighttime survival scenarios. This way, I'm equipped to face whatever comes, be it monsters or mysteries. Okay, let's stow everything away in the chest and take stock of what we have. All the remaining tools, diamonds, and some stone go in here. And let's not forget a few planks in case we face a monster ambush. All right, folks, the evening creeps in. Look at that, the sun's dipping down, casting a magnificent sunset. Wow, what a stunning sunset. <laughs> I'd love to capture this moment, but did I bring my phone? No, seems like I left it completely. Whoa, what's that racket? Oh dear, my bad. Looks like I squashed your house. I wondered what that was underfoot. Really sorry, Alex bro. Totally accidental. Oh, accidents all. You knew my spot here. Sorry about that, but maybe you should step out of the red circle. It's going to be freezing tonight. I'm sort of doing you a favor here. A favor, villager? I didn't need this favor. You've just wrecked everything. Ah, oh, truly sorry, but you might want to come out. It's chilly and all. Plus, we villagers have some warm tea and cartoons going. No way, no way, villager. Just go, just go. <laughs> well, well, folks, this isn't good. My shelter's destroyed, and now I've got to survive out here. But it's okay, it's okay. The villagers want me out, but I'm determined to stay put, get some sleep, and brave it through the night. Despite the setback, I'm not giving up, but there's still plenty of fight left in me. Let's see what this night brings. Whoa, a zombie. Guys, this is intense, really intense. All right, time for the shotgun. Let's make this count. If they dare come closer, it's showtime. But why delay? Time to take action now. Boom. Nailed it. I'm confident. Another precise hit. Boom. Target eliminated. That's how it's done. And boom, boom. Yes, yes. Triumph rings out loud and clear. Brilliant. We've nailed it with just one bullet to spare, but we've outlasted the zombie menace. They nearly breached our space. Phew. What a clutch final shot. All settled now. Pew, pew, pew. Discarding the shotgun, it served its purpose. The key now is endurance. The night is upon us. The moon, our only companion, signaling midnight has passed. Let's hit the hay and get some rest. Sword by my side, always ready. We await the dawn. So, we wait. Good night, brave souls. Good night. Good night. Good night. Maybe we just nudge him out of the circle? Like he accidentally rolled out while sleeping. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> Whoa, villagers, what are you doing here? Oh, yeah, hi, Alex, bro. Uh, we just came to check on you. <laughs> wow, villagers, seems I've made it through the night in the red circle. 
Well, yes, looks like it. I mean, you did turn into a one-man army against those zombies. Am I free to leave? Have I triumphed? Yes, step out, Alex, bro. The challenge is yours. Da -da. That means I've done it. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 you've done it. Oh my gosh. Can you believe it, guys? I've just spent 24 hours in the tiniest red circle. Villagers, time to pay up those five stacks of emeralds. All right, all right, Alex, bro. Here they are. You've truly earned it. Oh, just as promised. Look, five stacks. One, two, three, four, five. All correct, all correct. Thanks, villagers. It's a pleasure doing challenges with you. Darn, he actually won. Okay, next time we'll come up with something tougher, more interesting, more challenging. Yeah, bring it on, villagers. I'll be waiting for your next challenges. And you guys, you've been waiting for me to open the lucky block. I don't know whether I'll be lucky or not and what will come out of it, so let's find out. All right, I'm ready to open it on the count of three. One, two, three. Wow, look at that. A golden bow popped out. Incredible. That's awesome. Maybe not the ultimate prize, but hey, a golden bow and it's enchanted too. My fantastic friends, don't forget to smash that like button, hit subscribe, and drop a comment to share your thoughts on this wild challenge. As for you villagers, let's see what creative twist you come up with next. Yes, 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 Alex, bro. We're already scheming an even more cunning challenge for you. And this time you might just meet your match. Bring on the new challenges, villagers, red circles, or even a red square. I'm up for anything. A red square, Alex, bro. Challenge accepted. It'll be a game changer. Until next time, amazing friends, stay tuned for more thrilling escapades. Catch you all soon.